All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, who rule and teach well. And Shalom to the elect out there pushing out this word in truth and in sincerity. This is the brother Yahweh Allah from GMS Chicago coming with another lesson. And uh, pretty much this is going to be the English version of the video that was done yesterday with the brother Shakal um, on that uh, new diss track uh the new diss track that they did against the so-called, uh, uh, well, against the Hebrews, man, Hebrew Israelites, man, you know, with, uh, you know, if you guys seen the, heard the track, man, the still that they have in the video, they have, uh, Apostle Tahar on the top of it, man, you know, which is all, all things is spiritual, man, you know, because at the end of the day, the truth is with Great Millstone, man, you know, the other, the other groups, they might be teaching you that you're an Israelite, um, you know, the so-called, uh, blacks, Latinos, Native Americans are Israelites, but the whole 100% truth is coming out of great millstone, man, raw and uncut, man. All right. Without your feelings being considered, man. All right. You know, not, not trimming your waist to seek love, man. Okay. And for that reason, they, they want to, they want to kill, uh, they, they, they want to threaten brothers' livelihoods, man, you know, to the point. Where, 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 where they want to, uh, put, put, uh, kill you, man. All right. You know, but it is no new thing under the sun, man. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'll get that real quick. Um, is Ecclesiastes one and nine. The thing that has been. Is that which shall be, and the thing which is done is that which shall be done, and there is no new thing under the earth, man. So, hey, this thing is just uh, playing over again, man. You know, the same is the same condition the prophets have always uh, uh, been in, man. They're pushing out the word of the heavenly Father, you know, in, in truth and sincerity, precept upon precept, not caring uh, uh well, how you guys feel about the heavenly father we're going to let you know how it is right but um but for that you guys get uh, uh you two-thirds you guys get uh offended man all right matter of fact i, I also want to get this one um there's the book of hebrews chapter 4 verse 12 you know because when you're preaching out the word directly and correctly this is what's going to happen it's hebrews 4 and 14 for the word of Yahweh is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even the dividing asunder of, of soul and spirit and of the joints and marrow, and is the discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart, man. All right? So the Heavenly Father, man, he knows uh, um, the way men are, man. He knows the way he made humans, all right? He knows that we're in this flesh, man. And they, you guys, uh, uh, the flesh lusted after the spirit, man. The the flesh wants to do wickedness, man. And you two thirds, man, you guys have been given over to the flesh, man. You guys uh, want to do uh, 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 act like niggers, man. All right, do uh, 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 whatever feels good, whatever you believe is right. All right, doing you, you you getting yours. That's what you want to do, man. Disregarding everything and anybody and anything, man. All right, and, and the scriptures, they, they cut you, man. They condemn you, man. All right, the words of the Heavenly Father uh, are made for reproof, man. All right, let me see here. Um, uh, now, let's see here. This is uh, 2 Timothy chapter 3 verse 16 all scripture is given by inspiration of yahweh and it's profitable for doctrine I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go to it uh profitable for doctrine for reproof for correction for instruction in righteousness that the man of god may be perfect thoroughly furnished unto all good works man all right so the point is is that it's good uh the word is good for reproof and correction man all right, instruction and righteousness, man. And you guys have chose uh, you two thirds. Um, you guys have chosen death, man. You guys have chosen the way of darkness, man. The, the way of this world. 
the way of your flesh. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. You got you guys have um have chosen uh, uh the way of darkness, man. All right, and when we bring forth these words, man, they condemn you, man. You uh, here it is, uh, um the words come out, and now you can't live. Happily ever after in Babylon, man. You can't live cozy and, and comfortable in here because you have uh, so-called ne uh, Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans who are the true Hebrew Israelites. Uh, um, you know, you got uh, the northern king, uh, the southern kingdom, and the northern kingdom together in the highways and the byways, condemning you, man. Bringing forth this word, man, and it vexes your soul, man. It vexes your soul, man, and rightly it should. Rightly it should, man. All right, but we are we we've been put out here to reprove y'all thoughts, man. All right, and and, and um, and, and you're not gonna like it, man. <laughs> plain, plain and simple, man. I'm gonna get here uh, in Proverbs chapter 29, verse 27. An unjust man is an abomination to the just, and he that is upright in the way is abomination to the wicked, man. And that's the point, man. There's that the, the, there's always been. That perpetu that that hatred, man, against one another, man. All right, those that want to go after their own will is gonna hate those that are seeking after the heavenly Father's will, and vice versa, man. All right, but that whole diss track is is no is no new thing under the sun, man. It, it's 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 always been that way, man. Um, we have over here in Matthew chapter twenty three, verse thirty seven. Oh Jerusalem, Jerusalem. Thou that killest the prophets, so it's our own people that that kill that that killed the prophets, man. All right, just because y'all couldn't hack it, man, y'all couldn't take the reproof of the heavenly Father. All right, it says, "O Jerusalem, Jerusalem, thou that killest the prophets and stonest them which are sent unto thee, how, um, how often would I have gathered thy children together?" Even as a hen gathereth her chickens under her wings, and you would not. Right, man, because at the end of the day, the elect, you know, hey, man, and we're the, we're the hopeful elect. Well, hey, we, we're, we're out here to teach our nation in the way of righteousness, man. Because we know that if our nation, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, who are the real Hebrew Israelites, if you guys turn back to the Heavenly Father, he'll come back and redeem us, man. He'll come back and be on our side, man. And we won't, we won't no longer have to be li living uh, 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 um, foolishly out here, man. Li you know, li li living in confusion, man. We wouldn't have to be living under under the thumb of these of the heathens, man. And that's what we want, man. All under the rule of the heavenly Father and His Son, man. Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. All right, but you guys don't want that, man. You guys rather stay here, man. You two thirds, man. You two thirds ch uh, chose Barnabas over our Savior, man. A murderer, man. Who y'all chose, man? You're doing it again. You're you're you're, you're picking Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, over the heavenly Father, man, over his son. You guys are doing it all over again, man. Y'all, y'all are doing that, man. All right. So, hey, it's no, it's no surprise that that you guys are making this videos now, man. Hey, the, the brothers, you know, uh, we've been saying it, man. All right. It says, um, "Behold, your household, your house is left uh, unto you desolate." For I say unto you, you shall not see me henceforth, till you shall say, Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord. All right, but that's pretty much the point, man. Jerusalem, man, you guys are are, are wicked, man. You guys have outdone the deeds of the wicked. Or is it surpassed? Like you. Let's 
see if this works. Nah, man. You know, but pretty much, man, you guys outdone the deeds of the wicked. All right. You know, here it is. The two third, uh, the heathens, they don't have the law, statutes, and commandments. But you guys not only uh, not follow the law, statutes, and commandments, but you go, uh, 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 you guys add extra, man. You guys have to be uh, flamboyant homosexuals. You guys have to be, uh, you know, flaunt, killing, and murdering. Esau Edom, he, you know, he, he does it on a grand scale, you know. But you guys out here in music videos, uh, even on the blocks, man, you guys uh, 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 glory in that, man, you know. But whatever, man, it, it goes on and on uh, and, uh, and your idolatry, man, and all, in all forms uh, and ways, man, you guys outdid the deeds of the wicked. All right. I'm going to go to the next scripture, you know. Kind of, I could read these revelations here. 22 and 11, man. Because, again, man, there's no new thing under the sun, man. You guys are not going to change. This is uh, Revelation chapter 22, verse 11. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. And he that is filthy, let him be filthy still. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. So at the end of the day, man, that's the way it's going to be, man. What kind of person you are, all right? And at the end of the days... When Yahweh Shai comes back, there's going to be a, a, a great battle between good and evil, man. And we all know that, 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 that good is going to, is going to uh, be triumphant, man. So it's all good, man. We know you guys are going to talk shit. You know you, uh, 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 you guys are going to come after uh, uh, some of the Akia, man. All right? Uh, uh, but, you know, uh, hey, and, and, and I'm not uh, excluding myself in that either, man. We all got a potential uh, that these heathens, these two-thirds, come up against us, man. All right? But at the end of the day, man, it, uh, it all depends on which side you are, man. What side you're in, man. Because if you're in, the, you're in the side of the righteous, hey, uh, you know, you're, you're going you're gonna, to um, uh, you're gonna prevail with Yahweh Shai, man. All right? And at the end of the day, that's all that matters, man. That's all that matters. The Yahweh Shem Shai come and plead our cause, man. All right. Um, let me see. Actually, let me get this other scripture here. Lock you. To Second Ezra chapter four, verse twenty-eight, and I think I'm look for another one too. It says, "Lock you." It's uh, Second Ezra chapter four, verse twenty-eight. It says, "But as concerning the things whereof thou ask me, I will tell thee. For evil is sown, but the destruction thereof is not yet come." If therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down, and, in the pl and if the place where the evil is sown uh, pass not away, then cannot it come that which is sown with good. All right? So first this evil got to be destroyed, man. And then shall, shall the, 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 the righteousness come, man. All right? Uh, this is really the one I was looking for. It's Second Ezra, chapter uh, six, verse twenty-six. It says, "To lock you." Let me see where I could start. I'm sorry, twenty-five. Second Ezra, chapter six, verse twenty-five. Whosoever remaineth of these that I have told thee shall escape and see my salvation and the end of your world. And the men that are that are received shall see it, who shall have not tasted death from their birth. Hey, so some people aren't going to taste death, man. Some of the elect, uh, uh, the hopeful elect, well, pretty much the elect, are not going to uh, feel that death, man. All right, that's why I say you're going to get some of us, man. It says, and the heart of the inhabitants shall be changed and turned into another meaning. For evil shall be put out, and deceit shall be quenched. As for faith, it shall flourish. 
corruption shall be shall be overcome and the truth which hath been so long without fruit shall be declared and when he talked with me behold i looked by little and little upon him before whom i stood but that's the point man evil is going to be put out man yeah you you, you guys are going to be able to touch some of us so, uh, 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 speaking to you edomites and you two-thirds but at the end of the day evil is going to be put out man so fuck it, man. We we understand that that's part of the prophecies, man. But fuck it, man. Because at the end of the day, Yahweh by Hashem Shai is going to rule, man. He's going to rule, man. Not you. All right? You're not going to stay on that block forever, man. All right? And Esau, you, you, you're not going to rule over this land forever, man. All right? The triumphing of the wicked is but for a moment, man. So, man, it is what it is. All right? I'm going to end it off with these, uh, the last scripture. We could close it out. <clears throat> you know? yeah, I think that was it. End it off with this John. One of my favorite scriptures. This is the book of St. John, chapter 4, 4, verses 23. It says, But the hour cometh, and now is, when the true worshipers shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. For the Father seeketh such to worship him. The Most High is a true, is a spirit, and they that worship Him must worship Him in spirit and in truth, man. So at the end of the day, man, hey, have we become uh, your enemy because we tell you the truth? You know, and that's that is what it is, man. We're gonna keep telling you the truth because we want to worship the Heavenly Father, man. All right, we're gonna tell you precept upon precept, man. Whether the society uh, uh, accepts it or not, man. At the end of the day, we're not out here for that, man. We're out here to declare the, the righteousness of the Heavenly Father and and, 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 uh, and hopefully get delivered from the destruction that's coming, man. All right? Not wanting to be hand in hand with, with evildoers, man. All right? So uh, anyways, man, with that, I hope the elect out there was edified. I want to end by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. And Shalom to the elect out there pushing out this word in truth and in sincerity. Uh, with that, I say Shalom and a Baba Ball, brothers. Hey, Shalom.